Hello, bug friends. We are continuing down our meandering path. What's in a name? Looking at the insect order names, breaking down those roots, and letting you know how that helps you identify the insect. Today, we are continuing down this little rabbit hole of what used to be Neuroptera but now isn't anymore. We are talking about Raphidioptera. Raphidioptera are the snake flies, and both the common name in English and the order name talk about this insect's appearance. Raphidioptera, terra means wing, and raphidio means needle, and this is referring to that long ovipositor. Similarly, in English, we call them snake flies because they kind of have the body shape of a snake. Snake had wings and legs. I don't know, someone was feeling creative, I guess. You can tell why the snake flies were originally lumped in with Neuroptera because they have a lot of wing venation in their wings, which is what was originally keeping that whole group together. But there's been some genetic work that has been done. And so now we have realized that snake flies aren't as closely related to Neuroptera as we thought they were, and they actually belong in their own order. And so here we are. That long ovipositor that gives the snake flies their characteristic shape is used to lay their eggs either under bark on trees or under leaf litter. So this characteristic is actually really important for the insect's lifestyle and isn't just what we named them after. You can find snake flies almost all throughout the world, but they have really weird distributions. For example, I've actually never seen one because in North America, they're only west of the Rockies. And I lived in Connecticut and studied in Georgia. So that is not west of the Rockies. You can find a few in Central America and they're mainly distributed throughout Europe and Asia. In areas where it's warmer, kind of more tropical, you tend to find them at higher elevations. We don't have them here in Ecuador, so I've never seen one. I'd love to. It's actually on my list to see one someday. So maybe I'll get up to California and see one. So there you have it. The snake fly or the Raphidiopterus, the needle-winged insect.